Well, today, Lee Com and Elmira welcomed its newest first year medical students, and the community is helping them get settled in before their first semester begins. And WNY's Max Coven reports. Lake Erie College of Osteopathic Medicine returned to the lecture halls today. The class of 2027 is diving in headfirst at full speed, and they are all ready for the next four years. So I'm going to be here for the next four years, it looks like. Uh, I hope to do most of my rotations around here just because it would be ease of travel and such. Um, I mean, I'm really looking forward to getting to know the residents of the area and the area itself and just helping out the community in general. Students working to earn their doctors of osteopathic medicine degree will not start seeing patients immediately. They'll do mock patients, they'll work in our history and physical labs on each other and learn basic examination skills, but typically not with real patients until the end of their first year where they'll have an opportunity to engage. Dr. Richard Terry says becoming a physician takes a lot of time. Students are encouraged to go from lectures to eight hours of studying a day, averaging anywhere from 50 to 70 hours of individualized studying per week. For the first two months, it looks like there's going to be what well, was told by most of the faculty here, a lot of anatomy, which will be taking most of our time, and along with embryology and histology. Dr. Terry and the faculty say the class of 2027 is beginning their medical school journey at an important time. We welcome them all, and I think they're entering medicine at a critical time, a time of change where I think we'll see radical changes in the way that healthcare is delivered. Here's to the next four years. When the students graduate in 2027, they will be board certified doctors. LECOM officials say the new doctors joining the field will also help meet the need for medical professionals in rural.